So now that the inner barrels are now all clean and looking mint, it's time to do something with the faces. Now, I could have left them gold because they are in actually very good condition. However, gold, leaving things just how someone else made them isn't really my thing, you know? I've got to fuck with them. So the first idea was to go the Tiffany blue. To get them powder coated, I looked into it with a mate. Um, he said it was more than doable, that's for sure. However, I would have to outsource the actual um, material for the powder coating. Now, that's something I didn't really want to do. And I did feel a little bit bad, just a little bit bad, about fucking with the gold. So I found an even better option, thanks to the place I now work at. And that option is... Plasti Dip. That way, I can save the rim, I, I can get the colour I want, if I ever have to sell them on. Someone can take the Plasti Dip off and they've still got the gold. And, that'll also add just a little bit of extra protection to the face of the rim, when these wheels do see the track. But before I do, I need to give these wheels a damn good clean, front and back, because there is a nice layer of brake dust over the whole lot. So here's what we're dealing with. These two are obviously the front rims because the brake dust on the back is a lot more caked on. The rears just came off with a bit of a scrub. These are gonna need some uh, heavy duty, heavy fucking duty shit. So I might get the steel wool over, give it another coat and see how we go. Okay, so it's a pretty nice day. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna try and paint them outside. Hopefully nothing falls into it. Give it a shot. I've got a really bad feeling that he's gonna be fucking shit to paint. I'm not exactly happy with how it turned out, but yeah, we'll just let it dry, see how we go, see what it turns out like once it's all cured up, and yeah, before I do any more, because I don't really want to be wasting time and effort if it's just going to turn to shit, so, mmm, not fucking happy. Are you guys ready to see how these things turned out? Well, there's those two. They're not painted, which should give you a good indicator of how well the other two went. This is the first one. As you can see, I try to blast it off, which is how it gets this sort of a uh, textured effect while it was still wet. Didn't quite work. Not looking forward to cleaning that one. Then there's this one. Yeah, now this is the one I did everything properly. I, I miscoated it. So I did the light first coat and then I applied my four heavy coats. And now, I'm, I, from the camera, I bet you are thinking, oh, that turned out pretty all right. And it did. It did turn out all right on, say, the flat faces here. But as you can see just there, it just doesn't quite take. And then there's a big puddle where it just didn't take on any of the edges and then did this around all the rivets. And then every, Every backing section of the spoke here, it did that as well. So it looks good, sort of. It's just, it's just not up to my standards. So unfortunately, one day soon, 
I'm gonna rip all this stuff off and start all over again. Probably not with the Dupli color stuff as well, cause it turns out like shit. Oh, 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 oh,